think I want to be remembered is what I will do tomorrow. What I did is boring to me. Yeah. I think I'm too classic. <laughs> Gianni Versace was murdered in broad daylight this morning. Designer to the stars, Gianni Versace gunned down on the steps of his lavish South Beach home. I was driving to Rome to meet Donatella and Santos and the whole team for rehearsal. And um, I got a phone call 10 minutes before I got to Rome and I didn't believe it. This is a place where my emotion stays. Nobody believes me. I'm not a very secure person. You know, I question everything again. My vulnerability was always hidden. I was going home and crying, but closing the room because I didn't lose a king of fashion, which he was. In that moment, I lost my brother. Hi, Bo. I'm Donatella Versace. I'm in Los Angeles, getting ready for my next fashion show. Yeah, for the students to work in fashion, it's good to see people with that excitement and that they love fashion so much. For me, it's very important to help new generation, young generation. Palazzo Versace in Dubai was created in association with Donatella Versace, the sister of the late Gianni Versace. Donatella Versace played a significant role in continuing and evolving the Versace brand's design and style after her brother's passing, and she was involved in the design and aesthetic aspects of the hotel, ensuring that it reflects the signature Versace style and luxury. Palazzo Versace Dubai officially opened its doors to the public on November 15, 2015. This luxurious hotel and resort is known for its opulent design and association with the Versace fashion brand, offering a lavish experience to guests in Dubai, United Arab Emirates.
Now let's check out this beautiful room. I am overwhelmed with the Versace logo and the designs everywhere. It's so amazing. There are only two Versace hotels, let me tell you guys. One is in Italy and this one is the second in Dubai. It's all Versace cutlery. Wow, I love this. I would love this for my house. I am quite fond of cutlery. The fridge. Oh wow, this is a customized control pad of Versace. Usually in many other hotels, those are all iPads. This is a little dressing area and this is a cupboard entirely done up with glass and the Versace design. So beautiful. I like this cupboard. Uh, the Versace robe, the locker, and here comes the bathroom. Beautiful tiles, guys. All Italian Versace tiles. Bunch of toiletries with the Versace logo and the design everywhere. Wow. This is amazing with the placement of the tub is i'm showing you this bathroom area entirely because if you are someone like me you're going to check the bathroom first even if it's an expensive luxurious hotel <laughs> it's a moderately sized bathroom guys as i say but pretty cozy and well done up definitely classy let's check out the upholsteries so perfect wow I'm going to sleep on the Versace bed today. <laughs> the headboards, of course. <laughs> These are also Versace. And by the way, we didn't check out the chocolates yet. Let's check out the chocolates. Can't wait. Okay, unboxing of the chocolates now. This looks really nice, doesn't it? Such different kinds of chocolates, guys. It's so different. Oh, let's see. It looks like a bun, a little bun. Oh, really nice. And it changed the flower for me. It was a red. They gave me a yellow. In fact, I like yellow more. on this gorgeous water this evening i so wanted to go for a yacht sail however these are all private and well i saw a lot of uh, hollywood stars downstairs whose names i can't mention because of their privacy issue not sure how long they're going to stay but i saw the french footballer zinedine zidane as well because he's leaving tomorrow so i can tell you about him Let's go downstairs, guys, and see how the evenings are in the Palazzo. And there are quite a few restaurants here. And I'm all dressed up and all that, yeah. <laughs> Let's check out the Versace gift shop. This portion is of the different essence.
the Versace pens, which I already have in my room, the robe and the masks. Let's check out the chocolate and the flower shop now. All these women's body in fishtail dresses, these are all cake guys. Pretty and fresh flowers. This is gold leaf. This is real gold leaf guys. And this wedding dress, it's an original Versace dress on the inside and outside decorated with the Versace flowers. This is a wedding cake guys. Isn't it perfect? Looking at this wedding cake, a lot of women would want to get married. Me, not too sure. It can be for my birthday as well. <laughs> These are the handmade chocolates. So good. I think it's customized. Customize the chocolates or? Yes ma'am. Okay. Versace. Yeah, of course. I mean, I know that. But like according to taste of people also? Yeah. Okay. And how, how long do you take to customize um, a pack of... At this one day. So this seems to be the only unique Versace fine jewelry store based out of Dubai in Palazzo Versace. I'm quite shocked and surprised to know that the designs which are here are not even present in the main Italy shop. This you see is a real design of Gianni Versace, the late Gianni Versace. So most of his original designs of the jewelries are present in the shop and also the trendiest and the most unique pieces that are showcased in the runways all across the world in the primary countries and the cities are all based out of the shop. Isn't it amazing? Vanitas is an Italian culinary delight in Palazzo Versace and the chef is from Sicily, a Michelin chef, very very well known. La Vita is a stylish and sophisticated cocktail bar which serves signature cocktails, fine wines and other beverages. The spot is quite private, it's not very big but you have your own privacy. This is Palazzo Versace's multi cuisine restaurant Giardino where the buffet is served and I am confused where am I going to have my dinner here with this humongous spread of different kinds of cuisine or at the authentic Arabic restaurant. I heard the Arabic restaurant is also fantastic.
enough of serious recording now let's have some fun let me show you the bathroom of the visitors this is in the lobby level well which is the women's and the men's so many times in my life guys i have entered the men's bathroom and my iconic experiences were in france and one in bangkok in fact i entered a men's uh, washroom with a lady boy in bangkok can you believe it <laughs> Checking out the lobby area now. We checked out one bar and two restaurants. The lobby doesn't look like it has too much going right now, except for the coffee lounge. Because, as far as I know, the piano is also played in here in the evening. Looks like I'm a tad bit late for the evening performance. The pianist is not here, the vocalists are not here, the musicians are not here. But that's okay, I can always watch it tomorrow. Um, I have finally chosen my restaurant, which is the most authentic Arabic restaurant as they say in Dubai. It's called Enigma and it's placed in here at Palazzo Versace. I heard it's just amazing. So let's try the food now. While my food is getting prepared, I'm taking this opportunity to sit outside of Enigma restaurant, which is an extension, and enjoying the view posing. I'm taking a lot of photographs as well. People, if you watch Dubai Bling, if you watch some luxury series of Dubai, they ensure whenever they show dining or a restaurant, this is the exact spot. So many series and movies have been chosen so far. This is a beautiful scenery view. And of course, Enigma is a well-known restaurant at Versace. from our chefs. Uh, something very traditional to keep on the table is selection of herbs. They call it sabzi kordan and in Iran they love to eat these herbs with their food. Yeah? So wherever we come to your table, we pick any of the herbs and eat it together with this. Then we have freshly baked bread okay. and some homemade things like cheese we make in daily here. Nice pickles. You, you pickles. make it here fresh? Yeah, yeah, every day. Okay, and what is that? Tomato, pomegranate dip for your bread. Tomato and pomegranate. Yeah. Okay. And what is that? Uh, that's marinated olives. Oh, okay. And uh, I just want to know, what did you say about the herbs? As in, if you, uh, the first one that I picked, what did you say about that? Like, um, in Iran, usually during the dinner, lunch time, during any meal time, they keep a lot of herbs on table. Yes. And they eat it with wherever they eat. Yeah? So wherever they have on the table, they eat it, they take some of the herbs and eat it together. Right, right. right. Yes. The essence of this food, guys, is taking me to a dreamland. It's so phenomenal. Well, there's a lot of food in here and so well prepared. Each item is that kebab is though very large for me to eat alone. But I'm hungry. I'm going to eat it. And it's come with some aromatic rice.
it's late in the night almost empty the lobby is and i'm going to the lounge to end my day with some music Hi guys, so now our end of the night at Versace, um, it's been a lovely night. A few things about Versace, specifically I have to mention, it seems that as many times you go out of your room to party, to dine, to whatever, the housekeeping will come back to your room and they will do up your room and then when I come back at night now all my cosmetics that I used are in place the toiletries are, are in place my beds are done to the extra pillows for the night are given then I have to tell you something very very important I have never seen housekeeping to come back each time that a guest would leave okay so I just kept my wallet outside when I came back and then my wallet I check not a single penny from the wallet or anything from the wallet has gone here to there this is phenomenal everything was right in place the wallet untouched and this is what the brands do Dubai normally is a place where you will find the biggest of hotels and the hotel chains and brands there's nothing new about that but uh, well, one thing i can tell you everything about this hotel is nice something i had noticed significantly you know, the sheets were getting cold by itself very very fast even when the the balcony door was open or oh, another thing um, in here the ac works automatically so in a sense, whenever you open this balcony door, the AC is going to stop working. Then there's mood lighting all over the room, the bathroom everywhere. This is one relaxing place that I've found. And outstanding. If you want to be in the city of Dubai, yet a little away, this is like 10 minutes or 12 minutes from Sheikh Zayed Road. So this is all about Versace, guys. And until tomorrow morning, I'm saying a good night. You all sleep well, take care, drive safe, be good. I'm hanging out in the Versace robe and the slippers. Before sleeping, one, it's very comfortable. Second, these are expensive, very expensive. So it's like almost breaking your bank. And outside, this is beautiful as usual but very very humid right now it's crazy humid you know really really humid quite notice the versace medusa emblem look it can be seen now right nice 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 i told you guys good night but I think I'm just addicted talking to you.
Okay. I think I should get some sleep now. Right. Bye, guys. Good night.